Let's see what I got here. Rose gold red love bracelet. <clears throat> love gives one half year salary for individuals that teach in care for these children. For more info, ooh, baby. So we have, hey, 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 Scarlet's in the house. Hello, hello. How are you doing, sweetie? I'm just doing a last minute live because I've got so many packages to open. Moon goddess treasures, Crystal, how are ya? Hey, hey, hey. Wait till some more. Yeah, I am. Um, this is so pretty. I just opened this. Um, this is something that I, so many stuff and I forget if I buy or if I've got gifts. I do know some that I definitely bought and I know some are gifts. I opened this a while ago. I'm trying to think. Um, I think this might have come from Rosie's Closet. Not 100% sure, but... It is a really nice, um, I'll show you here. It's a bracelet that you can wear. That's a slider. So it goes on and then you tighten it so that um, it doesn't fall off. Very pretty. I really like it. I'm not a real bracelet person. I used to wear a bracelet all the time. My husband bought me. That's usually the only jewelry I wear is what he buys me. And um, he spent a lot of money for a bracelet that had like rubies and diamonds. And like it was about $500 or something. And I lost it. So I just stick with the studded earrings and the same old necklace that he got me. But this is really pretty. I really like it. And it says love. Give so individuals that teach and care for these children, for more information, go to www.fortuneculture.com. I think they made that. This is a rose gold called Red Love Bracelet. I really like it. So anybody else jump in yet? Um, hope everybody's having a good morning. I know it's early, but uh, I have so much to do today, and it's the beginning of the day, and I want to get this done. So who else? Let me see who's who's here, who's here, who's here. Well, hello there. You know what? I was um, um, running your video through the night. I think I did uh, send you a message, and you messaged me back about I woke up, and it was stuck on um, the one video you did that you were going to do a live, and you said it wouldn't let you do it on your phone, I guess. And um, yeah, so I just went to the next one, TJ. And then I, um, I ran it till just before I started doing this. I ran you this morning. Once I'm done with this, I'm going to put you on for the rest of the day today and uh, get you some more hours. I'm doing that with you. And Philly Flipper also needs hours. He just reached his 1K. Congratulations to him. So I'm going to run both of you two together on my computer up here that I'm on now. And then I have to go to the basement and do a lot of work. So that's what I am doing today. So it's all good. Um, he, uh, let me see here. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, let me see. Toilet girl. Yeah, bananas. It is bananas. It's bananas. How many packages I have? And I've telling like Victoria, I said, you know how many packages I have? And she's like, how can you do that? And usually I'm like, I don't know, because I can't. I get something, I got to open it. I just, I haven't had time. I really haven't had time. If you notice the thumbnail, I don't know if you've seen the thumbnail, but that's the pack. I have 10 and I have two others already started opening here. So yeah, that's how it is. Bourbon City Picker. Hello, Austin. How you doing? Andrew Merritt. Hi, Andrew. Thanks for coming in. Everybody's jumping in. I guess the um, notification went out. Caught up. Hi, sweetie. How's it going? 
Jarhead, sorry, I did not make it last night. Got to burn Carver clean and moisture. Hey, you know what? There were so many lives last night. I think I was on about five different ones. I was up till maybe about one o'clock this morning, I want to say, with um, Cameron. He is so funny. I just love Cameron. He cracks me up, but uh, his uh, feed wasn't too good. He knocked out, and Greg was in there. So Greg went on his channel, so I bumped over there and was on his channel for a while. Um, let's see. Hey, hey, hey. Hi, Michelle. How's it going? Everybody's saying hello. 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 Kathy. Hi, sweetie. How are you? How are you? And then I got my package of the birds are beautiful. My mom will love them come Mother's Day. Yeah. Um, they are, they're vintage, obviously, and they were in the description, and I thought of it when I mailed them to you, that the two baby ones, their bottom little things were missing, which was, I don't know if you noticed that or not, or if you read that in the description before you bought them, and I kind of felt bad because then I'm thinking, I hope you did see that, but I had them sitting in styrofoam, so if you put them in like a, any type of a container, a bowl or something, well, you know, I'm sure, just put star from on the bottom and stick them in and, and it looks, they're beautiful. And they, those glass birds, they're valuable. They're very, very, very nice. Um, beautiful, beautiful, very delicate. And I'm thinking they arrived all together intact, no broken pieces, right? I really try to ship pretty good, especially glassware or something like that. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. I'm doing good. Glad to see you back. Yeah, you know, I was sick for a long time. It seemed like for a month, but it was only about uh, two weeks I had take off. Yeah, the um, I had a hernia situation. It's all good now, though. Hopefully it doesn't come back. I'm really going to try to lose weight. I think that's a big thing and try to move more because sitting, I think, too much at the computer, doing so many lives now and doing so much on the computer. I really don't think it's healthy just sitting here. So I really have to learn to get up and move and maybe lose at least 20 pounds would be nice. We'll see. So I'm not sure. Oh, you didn't, Kathy. I'm sorry, but it doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I did really didn't think it would matter to anybody. It wouldn't matter to me because, like I said, there's an easy fix as far as putting them in um, styrofoam or something. They're so pretty sitting up and it's not like it's something you're going to play with. You just set them and go and just enjoy the beauty of them. That's for sure. Excellent packaging. <laughs> yeah, I love that. Came all intact. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Sitting too much is not good. And I'm telling you, Scarlett, you're my uh, hero every morning when you talk about getting on the treadmill. I used to do the treadmill all the time. I used to run on the treadmill and um, I hurt my um, I fell, this was a few years, actually it's been probably eight years now anyways, fell and broke my ankle and um, it's the strangest thing after I broke it, I was in the cast for like six weeks, um, walking cast and then on crutches and afterwards everything was okay and I was walking and trying to do the treadmill walking, not running on it, just walking and then all of a sudden my knee started hurting really, really bad and I went to different um what kind of doctor? Not not a physical therapy doctor, but um, I can't think of what they, what they are. But she looked at my leg and she said that I had a torn. How do you say that word? Macusis or whatever that is. And so I went to the doctor and they took X-rays and everything because the pain was just unbearable. Well, here it wasn't that. What they found out is, I guess somehow when I broke my ankle, a blood vessel running from down through my leg past somehow was cut off at the knee and it was going through the bone, a part of the bone in the knee and it got cut off. And so that bone, I guess, died. And so then after eight weeks of not wa walking on it because my ankle was broke, the bone died, but then it was trying to heal. And I didn't realize that. So every time I'm walking on it, the healing part wasn't solid and was chipping away. So it was pretty painful. So I had to go then another like six to eight weeks of being in a walking cast with a walker. Um, it was really not good. And then going to physical therapy after that and getting that. Anyways, they told me that running on a treadmill, I should not do anymore because of the 
I don't know, the bone just isn't strong enough. I don't know. Anyways, so they said the best thing to do is to get a stationary bike and ride the bike. So that's what I did. But let me tell you how many times I was on that bike. I could count one hand and I've had that thing for years. It just isn't for me. I so much would rather do a treadmill like you. So what instead I'm going to do, I think I'm just going to walk, just basically walk outside. It's getting nicer now here. So I'm just going to walk and see if that can help. You need to lose, right? Uh, yeah, don't we all, especially after COVID, man, just sitting here doing, it's hard. It's hard. But yeah, anyways, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to get to busy working these and say hello to some more. Oh, Dominic. Hi, sweetie. Good morning. Yes, I am so much better now than I've I was with the I hate all hernia, that's for sure. Being overweight and not healthy, not moving, it's not good. It is not good. So that is my goal for the next month. I'm going to get moving more, get off of this chair, out of this, away from this computer, and do more videos instead of lives and see if that helps. Yeah, elliptical, that's another thing they said, or a bike. Yeah, that's, yeah, but you know how, well, I don't know if you know, but for me anyways, it's like, eh. I'll do that later. And then I never do it. Yeah. Riding a stationary bike. Uh, I so much would rather do a treadmill, but so we gave our treadmill to our son. Anyways, good morning, Lisa. Hi, sweetie. How you doing? I'm wait, walk around about walking in the pool. Is that an option? Oh yeah. Swimming pool. Actually that is, they say is the best exercise ever because there's no um, weight uh, on your bones and whatever's hurting you. Yeah, doing it in the water. And actually, my husband did say about checking back into the Y to see if it's open. Believe it or not, he used to go to the YW um, because they had the best pool. It was warm water. It was so good and he was a lot of joints. So he's going to check into that and see um, soon if we can go back down and swim because, uh, yeah, water definitely. Saying good morning, good morning. They have that pedal machine you can just put on the floor. You know what? That's funny you say that, Dominic, because Dave, my husband, he just asked me that just this week. He said, do you want me to buy you that? Um, what is, I forget what it's called. So, so I sit at the computer and do that. And I, I told him, I said, really, I don't know if that will help. Do you think? Uh, would it make a difference? Me just sitting here and pedaling? I guess it's better than just sitting. So I might have him get me that because he did mention that. I, that's funny. Funny, funny, funny. Uh, my grandpa used to say riding a bike makes no sense to him. Why work your legs to death to give your butt a ride? <laughs> yeah, ain't that true? Um, sitting up at home, Jim, because I got to shed my winter coat. Yeah, we all do. Yeah, we had a room and actually it was a workout room and used to go in there all the time. And then you go through and I'm telling you, even just six weeks, if you're if you stop doing whatever. For six weeks, you're done. That habit is broken and you know how that goes. So yeah, it's a pain with the, that's what I did until COVID run. Yeah, that that's for sure. So you think that would help? Mm -hmm. Well, I might do that come fall because spring is coming up. Obviously it's spring and summer and it's getting nicer outside and I'd rather be outside than sitting here doing this. So I'm going to do more videos and just post videos and not so many lives and be outside because I love to garden. I love to, I'd much rather be out, walk the dog, do that for now. But I think maybe come fall, I'll have them, maybe by then they'll be on sale and the prices will go down too. Um, although I don't think they're that too off expensive, but uh, that's a good idea. So good morning, Stash. How are you, sweetie? Dan, hello. Good morning. Good morning. If anybody did not see, Dan, the answer man with Jimmy and Jeff on Jimmy's channel, old school picker. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I was howling and they did the uh, bean boozled challenge. <laughs> it was so funny last night, Dan, you guys cracked me up. I've been there, done that, but I was so fortunate and every bean I got was a good one. So I, I, <laughs> I just had to laugh. I just had to laugh. You can come dumpster dive. Oh, man. You know what, Kathy? That's my dream is go dumpster dive. And I've done it twice. And, um, yeah. <laughs> if we live closer, sister, mm -hmm. I think you're about, we figured that out once, about two and a half hours from me, I think you are. I should make that drive and make it a day. 
<laughs> that would be so much fun. Yeah, watch that replay. <clears throat> watch the replay. I'm on a YouTube diet. Well, at least I was too, with not by choice. It's just I didn't feel good, and I missed so much. Two weeks being off, totally here and there, hit and miss. I'd try to catch a video on YouTube, but man, I was sick. I, I had no desire. I was just hurting so bad, and I was in so much pain. But anyways, I'm glad to be back. So let's get to this. I did the rose thing. I have um, 11 packages to open, but I do want to say that um, Johnny, he does his holler dollar. And um, that's every week has been doing that on uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays. I can't do Thursdays because I take care of my grandson, but Tuesdays I'm there and I have bought a lot of things. That's why I want to do this now because literally last week, I think I bought 12, a dozen more packages that haven't even come yet. I just love supporting y'all. You know, I just love y'all. So anyways, I bought a t-shirt from, um, Billy Flipper, and this came. He surprised me. I had no idea he was going to put that in there. Whoops. How cute is that? Everybody knows. Can't really see it, what it says. My uh, camera's on my computer. It's not the best. Let's say go close and slowly come back. And it doesn't help. But you can tell that's Tinkerbell, and it does say when dreams come true. My dreams have come true from all of you. Okay. Um, talking to each other, right? Good morning, Larry. Hello. Good thing in the Texas heat will be here soon. Be easy shedding pounds in the garage. Ain't that the truth? You, without even trying, you'll be sweating like a pig. Yep. I know. Okay, you're talking about, oh, yeah, and you guys know, um, drop your channel, drop your links, anything you want, and I'm just thinking everybody in here knows everybody, and subscribe, but just in case, it's a Nana Tinkerbell pin. That is what it is. It really is. You are so right, and I love it. I love it. I love it. It was a nice surprise. Very nice. Yeah, very, very nice. Okay, and of course, there's a lot of thank you cards, and I did win, win last challenge that Johnny had on his channel for buying the most. So um, Dawn from Two Hip Chicks, there's their little thing, sent me their gift, and it was um, one of her t-shirts, which I wore not too long ago, wore that on our auction night that Victoria and I had Tuesday night. And with that, she sent me a box of peeps and some candy. Speaking of trying to lose weight. But anyways, so I have all the thank you cards. I mean, you all are just so good to me. It's amazing. Um, dropping them on the floor. Yeah, this is Philly Fippler. This is uh, the card he sent. Thank you, Nana. Enjoy the Tinkerbell. So he sent that little Tinkerbell. So anyways... Um, I don't want to spend too long. I'm going to try to get all through this and be done within an hour. So T and Kim had an auction, um, over the weekend, a couple weekends ago. Well, probably now, no, it's probably been a month ago. And I did open some of their packages, but I bought plush from them. And I also bought some jewelry. There's a couple rings that I got. I don't know anything about jewelry. But I really like this one. It's like a, I think that's a tiger's eye, I think. And like I said, some of this stuff I don't even remember what I thought. Because I'm just crazy like that. But I like to buy and support, and I like to keep, and I do have a nice large family with six grandkids. And if anybody, um, if anything does, I don't. If anything doesn't fit them, or if they don't want anything, then I resell and try to make money. Now I did buy these. This was a good deal. I do remember this to resell because when Kim and T had their auction, Kim really was getting rid of stuff, and so I think I got a pretty good deal on these. These are all handles, which I have to show these to my husband, but they're um, mother of pearl. 
and ivory. I know you can't sell ivory. Um, and these are all gun handles and Colt. That has a Colt symbol on there. By my camera. But I thought, um, what a deal for these. I, I spent um, $32 is what I paid for all of these. And I'm thinking I should get my money back from that. But this is, that's one. And then from that, there's four more. So that's like three all together of just the um, ivory. And then there's three. I don't know why there's three, not four, but the mother of pearl. Aren't those pretty? So I, I think I'll do all right on those. I should anyways. So that was the jewelry portion of what I've got from them. On, on the two rings, I spent $8 on those. That's a, that wasn't bad. Like I said, the one I'll keep for myself. Let's see. Picked up. Um, You just woke up. I've been up a uh, while, wow, two hours ago, Larry. Well, that doesn't surprise me with you, Larry. I had to switch my di um, diving hours. That's why I've been missing your morning show. Oh, switched the diving hours earlier in the morning, Kathy. Is that what you mean? Hey, Nikki, how you doing, sweet? All those nasty cakes. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Everybody's saying hello, hello, Dana. How old are your grandkids? My oldest grandson is 20, um, 26. On May 1st, my one and only granddaughter turns 25. Then our next grandson is July. He'll be 19. Next grandson is 16. The next grandson, the, the one that's autistic, he is nine. And our youngest one he is um, six. So they go from 27 to six, six grandkids. I have five grandsons, one granddaughter. We have three sons, five grandsons, one granddaughter. She's our peach. Yes, that's me. Good morning, Chrissy and Stacy. How are you? Earlier at night, I have competition now. Oh, earlier and instead of waiting so late at night, I got, that's what I thought you went like late at night. When I did mine, that's what happened to me was waiting for my girlfriend. It's the first time I didn't want to go by myself. So I was waiting for her and she was late and I knew this truck came behind me, two guys in it. And I'm like, mm, I know they're going dumpster diving. I'm watching them and sure enough. So they had already gone the whole way around because this was at the mall, strip mall, and they did all of those dumpsters. And, went, and so by the time she came, I'm like, there's nothing. We checked a couple. They, they had already cleaned everything out. So we went up to the other, up by the actual mall and Staples was up there. I got some um, things out of Staples and another place. I got a lot of good packing material, bubble wrap, but nothing extraordinary. That's for sure. But that's all right. Now I got this. This is says it's fragile. So if it really is fragile and it has that, what do you think, guys? You think it's probably broke? <laughs> uh, that's so funny. Trying to keep up with the chat. Um, wow, big family. Yes, Carly. This. Well, I come from a big family. I'm one of six kids, so. Um, in my family, it goes girl, boy, girl, boy, girl, boy. I'm the youngest girl, and then I have a younger brother. And to that, our little then, I'm going to send you. Well, you don't have to send me a care package, Kathy. You're such a sweetie. You don't have to do that. Boy, this Kathy, I'm telling you, she just does everything. My two little crumb snatchers. That's funny. I used to call them um, linoleum lizards or rugrats. That's funny. 
will be here next week to visit. Awesome. I miss that. Uh, my husband wants to have a um, uh, Memorial Day party on Monday. Haven't had that in. We've missed two Easter's now, Christmas nothing, Thanksgiving nothing. Um, kind of leery about that, but he's a heart transplant. So with him, his immune system, I mean, he takes the anti-immune system drugs every day. So he doesn't have any kind of uh, immunity. Kind of, uh, same with you, Kathy. And, um, but he said that uh, he's gotten both of his shots. Um Anyways, I won't go into that, but we're going to see if we can get family together. I do miss, I miss him so much. It's hard, very hard. Hey, how you doing? Um, hey, Efster, you, that's, you had a different name. It was K-Fry, right? K-Fry. And I'm trying to think now. I did buy these from uh, Johnny's Holler Dollar. I'm trying to think who... And you were selling, you said, <laughs> to do the sale, um, he said, Jesse, hmm, that uh, if we buy something, guess what he would uh, put in the mix? Speaking of diet, yeah, I'm going to start Monday, but I certainly better hurry up and eat these. He threw in a free box of your choice. There was a couple different choices. That's one of my favorites, so I picked Thin Mints. He had me sold when he said a box of that. But anyways, I bought um, wireless earbuds for my grandson. He goes through them like water. The 16-year-old one. He, I've already bought, I bought him a pair Christmas. And he already needs another pair. So that's why I bought that. And the cookies are bonus for me. So why not, right? Oh, uh, glad I got a granddaughter. And oh, she is. She's, so, she's 25 now. Well, she's going to be May 1st, 25. But yeah, she's definitely been our sweet, sweet. And the odd thing is that family, that's our oldest son. He's the oldest son. He married a girl who's the oldest girl of three girls. Now we have three boys. Her family has three girls. And they're both the oldest. So their first child was a boy. That's my oldest grandson. And on her side of family, they have nothing but girls. So they were so excited that he was born because that was their first boy. So then they have the second child a year later, and it was a girl. <laughs> so we were so excited because that's our was our first girl. So yeah, it all worked out. And then they didn't have any more. They were done. But that's all good. <laughs> that is funny. <clears throat> Do we have auction today? No, I'm just um just opening packages of stuff that I've bought and uh, gifts that I've received, and that's it. Um, just only auctions I'm doing is Tuesday nights for now. I remember that in your video. Yeah, I did that in a video. Yep. Strip clubs. What? Strip clubs are better than strip malls. <laughs> I did say strip malls, didn't I? Yeah. I don't know about them strip clubs. I guess. I guess. I don't know. Going down like one morning crew. Y'all trying to baby proof my fish room is going to be fit this week. Yeah, that'll be fun. Fun times. Baby proofing is always a good time. And busy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fry. Mm. Rescue and resell. Renee and Rob, how are you two sweeties? Yum. Girl Scout cookies. Yes. That's what, that's what I bought them. No way. Yum. I know. Right. How could I not buy? I said, okay, you're sold. I don't care. <laughs> um, Drop your links, everybody. Oh, you have five granddaughters. Wow. Um, My sister had... One, three kids, I'm sorry, five kids, three girls, two boys, and she said girls are so much harder to raise than boys. And I, I, I'm going to say that's probably true. Probably true, and I have no idea who this is from. What is this? It's from the post office. Oh, I wonder if this is tape I needed. I did want... Um, Priority mail tape. I need to get some tape. Maybe that's what this is. But they already sent me a. They dropped off a small roll. What is this? Oh, no, it's not. 
this is what I bought. My very first, I forgot I bought this. See how I am, guys? This was on sale because I had to get new cards. Thank you, card. Because I ran out, so I ordered, and I get mine through Vistaprint. I, I think I spent like $50, and I got um, like 400 of my thank you cards. So since I bought that, they were offered me a deal to get um, some merch, I guess. So I bought myself a coffee cup, just me. But ha, that's my merch. What do you guys think? People are asking if I'm going to get merch. I don't know. Small little cup, but I do like it. Forgot I bought that. See, there you have it. Now, I do know what this is. This is from D. DC Sells. Um, she does plates, license plates and stuff. Subscribe um, button, a subscribe button. She makes everything out of the metal. And all these links, I'm gonna once this goes, I'll, I'll drop everybody's link down below in the comments. I didn't do it now because I wasn't sure of all these packages, but I should have done hers because um, she does fantastic work so i uh, bought this here from johnny's dollar holler so if you're not a johnny's dollar holler don't know about it i'm gonna put his link down here below because it is fun you get a chance to win prizes you get good deals dropping your ebay links in there and people buy so come on This here is, um, that's what I ordered. I've wanted one of these for a long time. So what better time than supporting during Johnny's? Holla dollar. Holla dollar. I don't want to scratch it. Boy, D, you really taped this baby up. In cardboard. There we go. Whoa. Whoa, dropping a card. Oh, that's a sticker. That's her. Thank you. Says I love it in my plate. And I designed it. That's what I picked. She So, yeah, that'll go up. If I'm going to redo my back here, my background. So, I love that. Thank you. Thank you. That is awesome. I see some other people jumping in. Oh, my wife and I. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I've seen that before, and I said, holy crap, you just, you've been busy, man. You've been busy. Girls are a lot harder than my first. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I ordered party mail tape and got it in four days. Almost finished. I know. That's what I said. But you know, it's weird. I ordered the priority tape and I got um a small roll this time. Last time I got it was, I don't know if I did that myself or if they just sent it. I don't know. Hard to say. But uh, yeah, those are nice. Those are awesome. Yeah. They Cute cup. Thank you. Oh, and hello, Candy. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. I need an idea. <laughs> a collection, so I hope you do merchant. I don't know, Kathy. I'm think I'm on the fence about it. Um, that's another thing I'm on the fence about. I have a poll going in my YouTube channel. Go check it out under my community tab. Go vote. Let me know what you think because it's it's running close, and I don't know. You know, I have all those cups in my inventory in the green, red, blue, and black for sublimation. Oh. Oh, well, get them done. I like the green. That's what I'm saying. I like green. My sister has three daughters and one son. She has eight grandsons and three granddaughters. Sweet. Sweet, sweet. That's a big family there. I love it. Good morning, Susanna. How are you? Thank you for jumping in. I appreciate you being here. I'm going to try to get through this really fast. Casual flipper with the hearts. Love it, love it, love it. Crazy, right? And she's only 50. Well, Dan, you know what? I got six grandkids and I'm only 30. So <laughs> what am, you know what I'm saying? I love them grandbabies. I can, I know. 
That's what I always said. There's no words explaining what grandkids are like. I always say, if I'd know they were like this, I'd have had them first. Forget the kids, man. Let's just go right on to the grandkids. That's adorable. Thank you. Awesome, Nana. Thank you. Thank you. Nice design. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. I need to order some of those license plates blanks to play with. <laughs> yeah, I can play with them and do them, design whatever you want to do. Hey, Cameron, you're up. Cameron was having a fun live last night, drinking some beers, and then he went gone. And I told him already, Cameron, I was on with you and what happened. And we went over then to Greg's channel. Hello, April. Good morning. Thank you for being here. Lucky lived to USPS Shipping Supply Hubs. Oh, yeah. I bet you do get your stuff fast then. That's for sure. That is for sure. Okay, I think I got everybody else. And let's see. This is from Chuck. Something else I think I ordered. A lot of this I did get from um, Johnny doing his holla dollar. Like I said, I know I have at least another dozen. I was going crazy last week buying and ordering stuff. Just help people. Oh, yeah, this is for me. It's a note. Handwritten note. Isn't that sweet? How sweet is that? Just thank you so much for keeping my account. Mm -hmm. And thank you for such. I can read this. Thank you so much for purchasing my top. I bought a top for me, I think, if it fits, because I have fat arms. I have trouble with tops. And thank you for being such a great part of our community. Oh, I try. I love you all so much. We appreciate everything you do for the reselling community. Your friends, Chuck and Marcy, the back road bidder, and frugal peanut reseller. Yeah. And like I said, I'm going to drop everybody's link in the description below. So if um, you're not subscribed to them, please come back. You don't have to rewatch the live, that's for sure. But uh, leave a comment and um, check out their channels and subscribe to them. Support. So when I buy stuff and I, I want it for myself and if it doesn't fit, then I sell it at my auction. For less than what I pay, but you know, that's how it goes. This is pretty. Oh, I think this will fit fun. Yeah, this will be good. This is one I'll be able to keep. It's kind of um, see through, which I have tanky tops I can wear. Can't tell it on there, but it is kind of see through. And like I said, I have problems with my arms being so fat. So, yeah, this will work just fine. And I thank you. Thank you, Chuck. And we go. Love it, love it, love it. This is Rosie's closet. This is more clothes. Now, a lot of the things I, I'm pretty sure from her I bought from my grandson or my son. Love the purple. Purple is my favorite color. And then the lime green. That's the second green favorite color. Gotta get through this. Yes, everybody, please hit that like button. Thank you, Candy. Appreciate it. Anybody reuse bags? I do if they're nice. Especially if they're pretty like that. What the world did I order? I did not order all this, I don't think. Yes, it is. It is. Uh, that looks nice. Thank you. Perfect for summer. That's what I'm saying. Cute. Yes. All right, let's see. What do we got here? Card. Maybe I did order that. Thank you. Rosie's Closet. That's what I thought it was. Anna Ting, thank you so much for your support. It's appreciated. Crystal, you're very welcome, Crystal. And this is one thing I got. Your future looks bright. Journal. I don't remember the pin being with it. I don't know if she threw that in or if it was there. Don't remember, but what a bonus. Either way, that's cute. Just blank journal, blank pages. And I probably did a box lot because this is really what I wanted was this shirt um, for my grandson. I'm thinking... A nice shirt. Just a plain uh, tee. I 
Old Navy active. Very nice. Yeah, Crystal has nice clothes. So I got that shirt. And this, oh, I do know what this is. I actually bought these um, just on eBay because I was searching for something. While, when I was searching, something else came up. And this is what came up. And I'm like, ooh, I think I like these. And they were pretty cheap. And um, I like Bakelite. I think Bakelite is uh, really cool. And that's what I thought these were. I'm hoping that's what he said they are anyways. In this description. guess I should have opened this a while ago, huh? It's not what it is. I'm too late to return it. But it was cheap. So I'm thinking if it's that cheap, that's all I can remember. I don't know what I paid. But I'm thinking if it's that cheap, why is he saying these are Bakelite? Because it shouldn't be that cheap for all of these. They're chips. And they're all different colors. Poker chips. I think that's where I got these from. I'm just on eBay. Hmm. They don't seem heavy enough for Bakelite. I don't know that they are. I don't think they are. I'll test them. But anyways, there's all different shapes and sizes and colors. There are others, the yellow, oranges, red, white, and blue, and like a box full. I don't remember exactly what I paid for them, but I know it wasn't that much. But I'm thinking if I have, if those were all Bakelite, hmm. Um, there's nothing on any of them, no markings or company name or anything. But I, at one time, I do think that chips sold pretty good. But that's what that is. I'll check them out and find out. If not, they might be going up in my auction. When I have my auction, we'll see. Yep, we will see. Yep, yep, yep. Um, where am I at? I do. I saved Larry's big eBay bag to eat. Yep. Yeah. I, I mean, some are really good, especially really big bags that I get. I got something not long ago. And it was in, what was it? I can't remember. It was something very small. And I'm thinking it must've been the last bag they had was a huge one. Cause they like, they tripled it over and I, opened it very carefully and it's really a huge bag those are nice to have keep them out of the landfill as long as possible yep i agree with that reuse the bags yeah absolutely um hey everyone hello hello cameron yes me too yep we all do you guys drop your links um poker night with nana yeah you know what with my family we do go a family game night well we haven't in two years but um we used to do that. Here's a great story that I'm going to tell you real quick. We've done family night for years, and it's usually around February is when we do it, right? In end of February, right when the weather's crappy, it's after Christmas, nothing to do. The weather's ugly. So we do, I do a family night. I have a basement. I have a pool table down there, a huge kitchen um, table. Well, you've seen my basement. Anyways, be two years ago, like going to be three now, but I bought a game online. I thought this will be fun to play before this COVID started or anything like that. And the name of the game is Pandemic. Pandemic. So this is so funny because I bought that to play. And of course, when we have family night, my kids and, you know, we all drink. My boys drinking that. So I pulled that out to play. And my, my boys are like, uh, mom, no, we can't play this. We've been drinking too long. And this looks like a game. We really got to think and have strategy. And I'm like, yeah, it is. And they're like, we're not playing this now. No, we're not doing this now. So I'm like, okay, we'll put it away, play it next time. Well, we've yet to play it because then of course the pandemic hit. Who wouldn't, who would have known, you know, who would have thought, but yeah. So anyways, that night we played a game I made, uh, 
cool cats and ass hats. It's kind of like it, it's it. That's a fun game too. Too funny. But anyways, yeah. So I still have that game, Pandemic, and boy, I should have sold it because sales of that was pretty good during the pandemic. Oh, who is this from? How cute is that? The Treasure Hustlers. Oh, they crack me up. Those girls are so funny. This is a good story. Nana Tink on there. This is, um, uh, so they were having an auction with, um, oh, darn, who were they doing their auction with? I can't remember now. Who were they guests on? Oh, crap, Oli. Maybe Westside Gary, maybe. Hmm, see, I been, it's been a month. Plus, I got sick, so yeah, you know. But um, anyways, I was on there, and I saw this. This was a Tinkerbell, and it was there was a lot. that They were having a lot of things for sale, like a lot of something. And the only thing I wanted in there was the Tinkerbell. So I was bidding. Well, the bidding got too high, so I went out. And then afterwards, who had won the bidding then said, if and I, that's what I said, I was just wanting the Tinkerbell. They said, if you want that, we can do it, and it's yours. So anyways... The treasure hustler sent me this. And how cute. Hope you're having a wonderful day when you open that up. That's what I said about my Grove package. Handwritten note like that. Just something so simple. How adorable. That just, I love it. I love it. Just love it. Um, yeah, drop your channels, everybody. Yeah, because they do, uh, yeah, everybody unsubscribes to everybody. Gary, yeah, it might have been. I'm trying to think of his, um, I'm, I'm thinking that's who it was, was his. Yeah, support each other, please, please. Anything new in the community? Because I'm totally, oh, that's how I feel. I'm still, and hello there. How are you doing, Christy? I, being off, I was sick and um, I was hardly on the YouTube for at least two weeks. Oh my goodness. I just realized every single flap. Are you kidding me? How cool is that? Treasure hustlers. Those girls, I just love them. Present, yeah. From Michael. Michael, that's who it was. Michael was bidding against me. And um, I'm like, no, nah, I can't go any further. That's as high as I can go because I really didn't want everything. And the X's and O's. We love you. Yes, I love those girls. They are so cool. So, so cool. So anyway, let's get to this. This is what it was. You're not going to believe this. Oh, this just, ah. Is that me or what? <laughs> With her little thimble hat. I still want to take it out of the package. I know as a reseller, that's hard to do. But what do you guys think? Should I take her out? You see, I have, I'm going to reset this up, like I said, and make it nice. Because I have a lot of other things that people have sent me and that I've bought up there. A lot of Tinkerbell stuff from Josh. Flips, finds, and funds. And, oh, I don't know what to do. Is that not so cute? I love it. I'm just not sure. You know, I'm probably going to take her out of this. That's just how I am. I'll keep the box, but I'll take her out to put her up with my other Tinkerbell. She's so sweet. I am so Tinkerbell, you know, such a sweet, sweet thing. I love to tinker, tinker, tinker. But boy, don't piss me off. You'd rather be pissed on than piss me off. <laughs> Just say, I do love that. I love it, love it, love it. Oh, that. Uh, okay, what is this? 
Allentown, PA. Who's in Allentown, PA? Horizon Picks. I think that's what this is from. I think Mr. Buys a lot in Allentown, PA, too. But Horizon Picks, I think I've got this. Yeah, I know I did from Johnny's Aladala. Aladala. Let's see, what was this? Uh, Jennifer, hello, I didn't see you come in. I appreciate you, who else did I miss? Carolina Lady, I'm so sorry. Thank you for coming by, thank you, thank you, appreciate it. I only got a couple more packages to go and I'm trying to hurry, I don't wanna keep you all too long. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Preston, Coin Hunter, I'm glad to see you in here. Boy, I haven't been over to your channel in a while, just 50 minutes. Um, I'll go back shortly. Look, okay, I'll talk. I need a magnificent Funko. That would be freaking awesome. Totally. You'd, yeah, that is me, huh? Maleficent. I don't know what that word is. Okay, let's get to this. Um, Oh, no, I didn't. This is just um, something I ordered. Which somebody said on Johnny's channel. Or maybe I did order from him. Champions Road Enterprises. This is, um, I've heard, is the best. Because um, with this issue that I had, I hate it, I, I did read that um, licorice. And I, I was talking in chat about that. It's good for it. And it was helping. I was drinking some licorice tea and they were saying in the chat that Australian licorice is the best ever. I think Virginia was saying that. So I thought I'd never heard of that before. I have to try it. Australian licorice. You all ever heard of that? You agree? It is soft. I can tell by it, which I do like very soft. Yes, just 50 minutes. Preston, going on a two minutes. Do in a to do to do, do what? Guess what? Guess what is 15 football team? I don't know. Yes, she's a Disney villain. Okay, then I want one. Then I want one. Uh, like they're talking to each other. So yeah, I'm gonna try that. Okay. Three more to go, guys. Three more. Then I am out of here. I got so much to do today. Oh, uh, this is another thing. I did buy this. Dang, I forgot I bought this. It's a sensory chew necklace for my grandson. That's autistic. He has one and he really liked it. He goes through the um, plastic one, chewy things, because he always has to be doing this or he doesn't really chew them. He doesn't chew. Well, he does. Yeah, I shouldn't say he doesn't because he does chew too. But yeah, that's what this is. Bought that for him. We've got to take that over there. Okay. Now we have this is, I just got this. This is a gift from Josh. Flips, finds, in fun. And uh, I'm going to link this channel down below. If you are not subscribed to him, please go subscribe. He's getting close to his 1K. And he's always been good to me. He actually sent me, I don't know if you can see it, but up there, right there, is an ornament. Tinkerbell ornament. He just sent me that. I did not know he was going to. And then that Tinkerbell right there that lights up and she twirls and has fun. Her. He sent me that. And now this.
I like this packaging. You don't have a box to put something in to make it lighter weight. Put cardboard and paper bag. I've already done that. It's in a box. Something Tinkerbell. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, I already showed him what you sent me, buddy. And I said, I, when I'm done here, everybody's going to drop their, uh, I'm going to put their links in my description with my shirt. And um, everybody goes up to everybody. Yes, I wanted this. Puzzle play mat, soft foam, three foot wide. So yeah, I have to do something and put that, put this up here, like in my background. Tinkerbell lost puzzle play mat. That's pretty cool. Doesn't look like that. So I'll put that in my background. Thank you, Josh. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Last one, guys. Last one. Oh, this is another one from the Two Hip Chicks. This is what I bought. I just bought this um, not long ago. This is how it came. Package was had a hole in it, but thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Two hip chicks. Dawn and Mary. I know what this is. This will go my background too. Dan the answer man. I'm always so jealous of him. I'm going to, I'll never have a background look like him. It'll be a, a combination of my Tinkerbell and my Star Wars, my two favorite things. Uh, that's funny, Larry. Wait a second. I thought I only got one. Why is there two in here? The Mandalorian. Cereal. So do I open them? The child. And eat it or just save the boxes. And I hmm. Dawn, I didn't know I was getting two. Did I get two for the price of one? And look at all this great bubble wrap. Bonus. So yeah, two boxes. Thanks, Dawn and Mary. One from each of them. Thirty Yoda, and I can never remember how to say his name, although I've been told a million times. Gruko, Grunko, Gumko, Goonga, Gruka, Guga, Grugo. I forget. Baby Yoda, the child. Cool. So that's what I got. Oh, now that's it. Done, 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 done. Mm -hmm. So, um, Dan the Answer Man, his background, if you haven't seen his background, full of Baby Yoda and a few other stuff. BB-8, which I love BB-8 too. And uh, so I got like half Star Wars stuff because I love the Star Wars. Half Baby Yoda Grugo because I love Baby Yoda. And, um, yeah, well, I'm, I'm wearing, oh, do you see that little mug up there? That's Mountain Man Treasure mug. Sporting him today. Mountain Man Treasures. You see that boob shot? I'd love to support everybody. Okay. So, the, um, been about an hour now, and that's what I wanted to do was an hour. So, um, thank you, everybody. Thanks for the love. Oh, Dan, you're the awesome man. He just cracks me up. 
open from the bottom, take out the bag of cereal and put up the box. Fabulous idea. Fabulous. And fill the inside with um, pebbles or something to keep the box from not being crushed. That's what I'll do. Will that make it less valuable in 20 years? Not that the cereal will be any valuable at all, but I don't, I, I don't know. What do you think? Great bonus, free shipping supplies. I know, right? That's what I'm saying. I'm talking about themselves. Who is Preston? Do we know him? Preston coined 100. This open can say is not. Don't need just one. To wear Preston Allen LLP. I watch a couple coin pushers and a couple of coin hunters and coin people, and also um, metal detecting people. And I don't get to watch and go watch their their lives or their videos a whole lot, so I don't really remember the names. So, um, Preston, I, I think I have, I, th yeah, I think so. I think he's, I think you're good. Nana, did you get the package from me? I'm not sure, April. I didn't open one from you today. And I have no more packages to open, except I'm going to do another video because it's a huge video of plush that I got. And I know I didn't get plush from you. Um, I think I would have got a shirt from you. Tell me what did I get from you, April? I think. Um, <laughs> from, from the dumpster. Yeah, I've gotten a good package in foam, the thinner foam that I actually wrapped nice glassware in. So thanks for the company as I packed this morning. That was uh, early this morning, Cameron. Have a great week. Oh, the, yeah. The, you're, I'm glad you got more uh, packing done this morning. It's like you've been packing since midnight last night. So thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, yesterday his stream just kind of went blah. His um, Wi-Fi out in his shed was not too good. It's all good, Jennifer. It's all good. The Mary Kay from you. Okay, I know. I did not get... Um, was it blush? I did get blush. I did get that and I opened that on live or in a video, one or the other, but I did open blush, but I don't think that was Mary Kay. I think what I got from you was not a compact. I think I got something else from you. Okay. Preston. I'm back. I had to give dad his morning way. Okay, then it says delivered. Then that's what it was, April. It was that that I got. Yes, I did. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go because it's on the hour and that's all I wanted to do. And I just want to get this done. So I want to thank everybody for stopping in, saying hi, spending an hour with me this morning. I know it's early. So um, thank you all for being here. You all are the best. Stay humble, be kind, have a good morning. And uh, see you all later today in chat. That's for sure. There's a lot going on. So have a good day, everybody. And thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you all for now. And I thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Have a good day. <laughs>